Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode, another episode of Big Ambitions. We're trying our best to recover from almost bankruptcy, so let's see if we can uh, shoot towards the goal of uh, getting that uh, getting that Rolls Royce, you know? So let's hop right into it. Okay, so we're back, we're back, and uh, we're still kicking, it was close last time, it was really close, uh, I almost uh, went bankrupt, that's for sure, <laughs> I almost went bankrupt uh, 100%, uh, with the help of my some of my, uh, my viewers, we managed to recover, and uh, we managed to turn things around. We're still making a little bit of profit. We're still making some some revenue with our uh, yeah with our uh, gift store. Uh, so let's see if we can actually turn this around, and if we can actually uh, I don't know shoot towards that goal of getting that uh, fake Rolls Royce or something like that. Uh, so uh, yeah let's see let's see so the idea was that I'm gonna close down my raccoons king my burger shot my burger joint and we're gonna try to set in there another business somebody told me that we can we can uh, reorganize the business I actually I don't know let's check that first uh, five alerts we don't care settings okay so I can change it from here so uh, I don't know exactly what's the best approach but I know I can import I can import let's see if I go to my employees and I go to my purchasing agent right uh, I know I can I can get cheap jewelry in as well as an import and that might actually be what we need i don't know exactly i don't even know exactly what we need for jewelry but i guess we're gonna we're gonna find out together uh so i need to put in an order of minimum 2500 i was ready to put an order in last uh, last episode but cheap flowers yeah i need i need a way to get uh, expensive gifts i need to find a way to uh, get expensive gifts um i'm gonna see if i can hire another another purchasing agent and then if i can have um i mean i guess you can operate with the same warehouse right so i can use the same warehouse okay so you're doing great, kid. I am very impressed. In fact, I think I should back off a little bit, give you more space, so you can continue building up your retail empire on your own. Okay. So yeah, basically what my uncle wants right now for us is to reach a daily profit of 3,000. I don't think I can. I don't think I can with... with my... with my gift shop. Because he wants us to reach a daily profit. Oh, actually, I was almost there. Let me see if I can actually do this. So let's go. Let's go eat. Let's give it a couple of days. Let's see if I'm going to be there like 24 hours. If I can, uh, if I get to the point where I can. We still have some. I guess I, I could actually make that profit if I just uh, if I just uh, fire another one of my employees or something. 
So let's give it a try. Let's give it a couple of days. Let's see if I can do in a couple of days. Three thousand profits since I was so close. I didn't realize I was so close. Uh, I'm not gonna eat now. I think we established that we don't have to eat. So let me check again really quick my oh. Is it going to take into account my... Yeah, no. I think this is the daily profit that I have to go over 3,000. And I can't, I'm can't. i nowhere near close. Like, maybe this shop is going to make... Yeah, I reach a daily profit of 3,000. But that's not going to be just for one store. So, this is not going to help me. So, I'm going to let... I'm going to let uh, this thing to keep going. And I'm going to see what do I need to acquire some stuff to start. Yeah, to start a jewelry or an alcohol business. Apparently those are the, those are the, the good ones that you can profit from. So, or it might be another idea to just move the the gift store in uh, the gift store in the other location so uh if i go to yeah i wanted to see the schedule can i see the schedule here i i know there's multiple ways to do stuff okay so i'm open from 8 to 10. i think that's fine for now uh, so I'm gonna go to sleep. Yeah. 6 a.m. should do it. Yeah, see, I'm not even close. Even if I work there. Okay, so I think the plan is to find out... That's my van. It's funny how I had the dark blue van and I always find like found like dark blue vans on my street parked and now that I changed my van to black now all the vans are black you know <laughs> it's funny and weird in the same time uh, if I go to Vugo maps and I uh, I go to the not office supply actually it might not be a bad idea to get another desk in there but if we if we go to the what's it called appliance store, right? We'll go to the big one over here, open in Bismay. Uh, let's see if we can find what we need. So this is for bakery, this is for clothing, this is for cigars, freezer. Jewelry, f man, yeah, I'm not opening up a jewelry floor showcase. <laughs> a jewelry floor showcase is ten thousand dollars, so that's a big investment. Product panel, is this what? What is this for? A wine shelf, okay. A wine shelf is not is not that expensive. What else do we need? I think we need some some fridges right some industrial fridges for alcohol and stuff what about for tobacco cigar shelf okay so i might be able to do this i might be able to do a yeah i might be able to do a cigar let me see is it gonna give me any kind of uh yeah we're not gonna be a fast food restaurant anymore that's for sure so if we change this to liquor store, yeah, liquor store, and we're gonna not name this Raccoon's King anymore. Uh, we're gonna name this Liquors and Cigars. No, uh, it's probably too long.
Ah, I'll just leave it like this. Yeah, we're not gonna be. I'm gonna save this. Uh, what's a good logo for a cigar and alcohol business? Oh, well, this is kind of a more of like a restaurant, right? We have diamonds. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. What should I choose? This is clothing, coffee. Yeah, I don't know if there is something for cigars and liquor. So I'll just stay with this, I guess. I'm gonna leave it like this. Actually, yeah, let's leave it like this. Okay, so now I'm a cigar and liquor, right? I have two cash registers over there that I'm sure I can still use. I need a stack of shopping baskets. That shouldn't be minimum one product. Oh, I have sodas. <laughs> okay, requires one stack of shopping baskets. Has not opening hours defined. Industrial grill is okay. I don't, I don't, I don't need this. I need some sodas, which I should, I should go get. Uh, I'm hoping that cigars and stuff are not gonna be so hard to to come across. Actually, let's see if we go to the whale or uh, yeah, the, the wholesale store, and we go and open up in. Let's see, cigars, 623, 2225, wine. Okay, do we have anything else but wines and cigars? No, so I think that's all I need, which is not that expensive. Okay, so let's go do this. Let's go get, so we're going to the, uh, we're going to this place and we're getting a wine shelf and a cigar shelf. Okay, that's like a little bit over 3,000. We're going to start with one each. Um, do we need anything else? No, and we're going to pack all the tables and everything for now. I think that's the plan. Oh, and... We have to find some employees right away. So let me call recruitment agency. Oh, it's too early for them. Anyway, so let's go. Where was the place? It was was just down the street from us. Yep. I just woke up. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Chill. Just walking. Okay. So we're gonna go to this. Uh, and we're buying, we said, this is a wine shelf and a cigar shelf. Okay, I'm gonna start with one each. I'm gonna get two shopping baskets as well since I'm here. Oh, yeah, I need to pay. Guess what? You need to pay for stuff in this game. Yeah, I really need I really need to hire some more people to find imports for me instead of just just buying from here because I think
wholesale. Here I come. Uh, I don't even know. Do I need paper bags? I probably need some paper bags as well. What can I... How can I find out, or where can I find out, what can I sell in my store? Because I don't know if I can sell sodas as well. Uh, inside? No. Maybe F1 is gonna help me. Sellable products. Business types. So if I go to liquor store. So I can business of these types can sell bottled wine and cigars. So I cannot sell not even sodas. No. Okay. So I don't need any sodas. I need the. Uh, I think I need paper bags, right? Like it will make sense to need to do paper bags because you need to put the. You need to put the stuff somewhere. Okay. Expensive flower jewelry, cigars, and bottles of wine. Yeah, let's get four of these and two of those. I think this is gonna be a good time to try and call these guys again. It's a Thursday. Let's give them a call. Okay, right, so we need for okay customer service. We need three candidates. Kind of want at least two of them. Actually, three wouldn't be bad. Let's do it in. So I'm not saving a lot of money. Let's do it in one day. And then can I do a cleaning lady as well? I don't wanna I don't wanna clean anymore, okay? I'm done cleaning. One in one day. Yeah, let's just have one. Hopefully it's gonna be a part-time one. Oh yeah, do we still have I, I think pausing it is kind of useless, but I just want to, I don't want to waste time. So I still have some money, hopefully I'll still turn a profit with my gift shop. I know I'm going to have to buy some more expensive gifts. So after I do this, my next goal is gonna be to to definitely. Okay, look at my look at. Sorry, sorry, my bad. It's completely my bad. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to do a lot of work here. Let me go pack everything else first. I think that's gonna be a good idea. Okay, so. Pack. I'm gonna leave this here for now. 
I'm gonna leave those there as well because who cares? Uh, pack. Trash bin. I mean, it's not bad to have a trash bin. I don't think it matters. I'm gonna put it here by the door. Okay, and I definitely don't need. But I'll leave them there. Maybe they just wanna enjoy their wine here, you know? So it wasn't that much. Oh, actually, no, I don't need. I don't need these either. Because otherwise, they're gonna stress me out. Okay. Uh, hand truck, wine shelf, cigar shelf, two stacks of shopping baskets, and then I'll come for the merchandise. Doesn't make a lot of sense to have, yeah, to have this stuff behind, so I think I'm gonna rearrange things a little bit. I'm gonna put the cashiers here. Okay, so if I get the cigar shelf, place it. Uh, looks ugly. Almost the best approach. Let me just pack these as well. Give one speaker here. Harley Davis. Oh, is this the guy that wants the special coffee, whatever? Harvey Davis, my employees. Harvey Davis, yes, is the logistic manager. He wants his coffee machine. Oh man, I have to see. I think I can buy one of those at IKEA. But if I don't want to lose him, I should uh, do something about it. I have one speaker there, one speaker there. Man, I have a lot of speakers. I don't know, I'm gonna put one here. Okay, so. Shopping baskets. If I move this here and here and put the other one here. This actually looks good. Okay, and then the one sh wine shelf. It's gonna be here for me. Wait a minute. Oh. Oh, really? So I haven't even filled up the shelf. I need a lot more cigars. Hmm. So I probably got too much wine, not too much cigars. Not too much wine either. No, not play. 
place. Grab. Now I'm gonna place on this one here. And then this one. Okay, so theoretically, I should be able to start this business already, right? It's... Let's make it, a, let's give it a schedule. Oh man, so one cigar shelf is only gonna serve 10 people per hour. Same with the, the wine, yeah. Okay, so I'm good with the cash registers and I'm good with the baskets as well. But I'm gonna need to buy three of each and fill them up as well. <laughs> That's gonna be fun. That's gonna be very fun. Okay. Uh, let's give it a schedule. For now, only eight hours from 10 to six. So I can open it up today, actually. Out of burger, out of burger. You know what? I'll do it after hours. I'm gonna pick up, pick all of those up and get them out of here. Oh. Already have inside myself. Yes. Why are they going behind me? I don't like that. Let's see if I put these like this. Okay, let's try this. Okay, I sold some stuff. Yeah, I want to pick up. I want to pick up all of these. And not have them here. How do we do that? How do I pick these up? Now, if I click on the... Let me try this. So if I click on this and then I click on the... Oh, okay, that's how I do it. I think I'm gonna put them in the warehouse or something. Yeah, I was getting alerts because of them. That's kind of weird, like they were packed in a box, but I was still getting alerts. Okay. I need to move this speaker. Yeah, let, let me put it here, maybe people are not gonna go through there anymore. Okay, so I obviously need... I need more cigars. And, but for now we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna see how this works. So we're gonna go home. It's actually, no, I'm not, I'm not close. I keep saying that this place is close to the park, but it's not. It's, I should actually stop to get some groceries. Why? Okay, if I can 
place this in the car, I'm gonna go get another bag. Because I'm keep... I like the neighborhood where I'm living, that's for sure. In the parts here, even if it's a little further out. But I don't want to go crazy water park again. Okay, so what do we want? We want paper bag. I need to get something home for entertainment as well. But I think my next thing is gonna be getting that guy's uh, coffee. Which. Let me get this. If I get the cabinet with drawers, I probably can put this in. Because I need probably to put the coffee machine on something. Oh man, this place is ugly. But. Have you guys heard anybody complaining about it so far? I don't think so. Can I go grab a... Let me grab my food first. If I go grab a... Can I go outside with the mop from the other place? Just try it out. Why did I got it? I don't need to go in. I need to manage paper bag. So if I go to my store over here, and I grab a mop from my cleaning... I'm running out of expensive gifts here as well. Soda cans, paper bags... So if I get the mop from here... Nope. Uh, this is gonna take a lot of time, but let me get my You know what if they're not complaining why am I complaining? Where's the Molly Jones Do you have any issue that the our our workplace is dirty? No, so why should I bother? I know you you're having a problem with your Yeah you're having a problem with your coffee machines and I'm gonna get that sorted in just a second. I'm gonna go to sleep for till six. Cause I need to go that, get that guy some coffee. Uh, I think I need coffee machine. I think I need to go to I need to go to Ikea, right? Oh man, then they open up at 10. But they're open up until 21, so I should go after hours. Uh, and if I go here... No, they don't sell... They don't sell coffee? They sell fridges, but they don't sell coffee machines? That's kind of weird. Right? Oh, no. Cheap coffee machines. Yes, this is the one we're gonna get. Okay, so what were the hours of my place again? Yeah. So I need to go after hours. Right now I need to go to work. Uh, should I go... Resupply with some stuff? Let me go... Yeah, let me do this. Let me stop by the warehouse. Oh, um, 
Hey, Saint of Irene. Uh, you haven't been here last night? Until the end? Yeah, I went negative and I couldn't afford food and yeah, I messed it up. Messed it up pretty bad. Can I leave my stuff in the warehouse? Yeah, so I messed it up pretty bad last night. I almost bank went bankrupt. Actually, somebody from chat gave me some ideas. And... Uh, That's how I managed to. That's how I managed to stay afloat. I'm gonna leave this here. I'm just gonna take this other thing here. Yeah, I had to close one of my business. I had to. I had to fire. 80% of my employees, except two. Yeah. We had some fun. I thought that's gonna be it and I'm gonna restart. But... I managed to... Yeah. <laughs> I managed to turn it around. Well, if you really care to see me panic, you can either rewatch the video from last night because it's saved here on Twitch, or this is gonna be on YouTube in a day or two. Edited and everything as an episode, so yeah. I didn't really panic, I was like I was like, you know, I kinda wanted to go hard in this game anyway, so I think I have the knowledge to go hard now. So I I was kinda like, yeah, you know, I'll just I'll just do that. But uh, I didn't have to. Actually, Zero. He was pretty active here yesterday in chat. He gave me some good ideas. Oh, there you go. I actually might not have to go to work. Uh, female, part time, man. Please. Oh, cleaning. Oh, no, that's good. Wait. That's good. You're hired. That's good news, not bad news. Yes, I'm gonna sign you really quick. Really, really, really quick. Primary skill customer service? Did I read that wrong? No evening shifts. I think I read that wrong. Okay, you're gonna have... this for now so I'm gonna Libby is that the her I'm gonna have her work this weekend so I don't have to worry about it I'm actually go handle the second register but yeah uh, man I thought I actually got lucky for once but no 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 there's no thing like luck for me remember remember that as, our, as, as you guys are watching me, always remember, I never get lucky in any game. You can have them work outside of open hours. Oh yeah, I, I know. But that's not the cleaning person. Thing. I thought it's a cleaning person, but it's not. I have it. Yeah, I have my... If I go to my gift shop, my cleaning lady... Where are you? Wait. Where is it? Schedule. Yeah, my cleaning lady does the does the cleaning job before and after. No, uh, did I? You might be right. <laughs> uh, you might be right. You might you might be right. Let me check. Schedule. It is the cleaning station. You're a hundred percent right. 
good catch. Thank you so much. I wasn't paying attention and my store would have been closed. No, it's it's not it's not cleaning. It's mainly mainly pretty sure that's what she said, right? Yeah, primary skill customer service is not cleaning. I was happy because I thought I got the cleaning person with part time, which is pretty good because you don't need to pay them that. Like if you have them one hour a day in a place, they're fine, you know. But yeah, anyway, let's pay for this. So I don't need to worry about opening up. I'm gonna go get that guy's the, the coffee. There you go, actually I might have my second employee. Cleaning, this one is the oh, and of course it's full time man. Like I I never get lucky. I want a part time cleaning person and a full time customer service. Ah, there's no way. Full time, I know. You want 30 hours, right? Of course you want 30 hours. Why wouldn't you want 30 hours? Doesn't even have to be that long. Yeah, I know. I wish there was a way to... Because I cannot have her work, otherwise she's gonna get upset. Wish there was a way to copy-paste days or something, I don't know. I'm gonna get the other person, the other cost, customer service person. And that's gonna be a full time one. Otherwise, I'm gonna be in kind of a pickle. Sad. Sad that I'm. Oh, that's over 30 hours. So let's actually go two hours in the morning, two hours in the afternoon, three in the morning, three in the afternoon. Let's see. And lower the other ones. So bam. 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 This is actually 30. And 3, and 3, and 3. Let's do 3 and 2. Yeah, I want to have exactly. Exactly 30 hours. There is no reason to pay this person one hour more. Okay, so we're gonna lower the morning shifts a little bit to small. Okay. Okay, so are you happy? Yep. You're happy. You're happy. Oh, do I have already the other one? No, hired, hired. I still, I'm still waiting for one. I need to go to IKEA and get that coffee machine. Yo, be careful, man. We're still in the parking lot. Man, I hate IKEA. I have to go through almost the entire store. Okay, where would I find the coffee stuff? I mean, I'm guessing... 
There you go. Another part time. Oh, why? What did I do to deserve this? Why? 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 Default. Okay, so I have her for the weekend. It's not even going to be enough to... to cover my entire week, or is it? Well, no. It's two hours over. Well, I guess on Sunday. No, because that doesn't help us. The way I have stuff set up right now. Wait, what did I do here? What's wrong? 10 to, 10 to 6. And this person has 30 hours. Isn't it the same? Man, am I, am I stupid or... How can this person work one extra day and have only two hours over? Yeah, I'm getting scammed somehow. Unless... Unless working on a Sunday or something means more. Oh, it says 24 hours per week here. But see, here. oh, yeah, so it's a bug. It is a bug somehow. Oh, I was looking on the wrong person. It was me. It was not a bug. Okay, that's going to do it. 28, 28, 28, 30. Okay. Okay. I was being silly. I was looking at the cleaning person. I was like, how is this exactly 30? And this is, yeah. No, right, that works for now. Uh, next of computer, traffic sign, armchair, regular chair, door lamp. I was hoping I'm gonna find everything here, but I guess not everything is here. So where's the kitchen area? Here? Here. Here's the kitchen area. There it is. Cheap coffee machine. My employee is picky. There's nothing I can do about it, right? this
even now I have a full shelf. I should have bought a TV as well. Oh, I have another employee? Did I ask for three? I think I asked for three. Tell me this one is a full-time one. Another part-time one, man. No knife shoots. Okay, let's do this. Let's uh, make the schedule for Monday. Wait. Not really Casey. Libby and Owen. Let's have them all here. Twenty-eight, twenty-eight, thirty-five. Twenty-eight, twenty-eight, twenty-eight. Right? And then... And then, I don't know, Sunday, let's untick this, we need to get at least 30 to this one, and then we should have these exactly at 30, so... Thirty, thirty, thirty. I think I have it. I think that's gonna be it. No, this one has. It says no night shifts. What does that mean? No night shifts. I guess we're gonna find out. Nothing between 22 and 4. Ah. Let's do this then. Twenty-eight, twenty-eight, twenty-eight again. And Sunday. Oh no, I forgot to untick it. Man, maybe one of these days I'm gonna finish the schedule. Okay, so now I, we're picking Sunday. We're moving this person here two hours. We're moving person here two hours. And we're moving this person here two hours. That's what I wanted to do. And then this person is gonna do. Yeah. 28, 28, 30, 30. There you go. 30, 30, 30. 
30 is the, the sweet spot for part times and full times, right? So let's give it to that. Uh, okay. So what are we doing here? We're parking. We're getting. Okay, let's see. Are you happy, my dude? Are you actually happy? Are you actually happy now? You're the purchasing agent? No, you're not the purchasing agent. You're the logistics manager. There you go. There you go. Okay. Hopefully, you're not going to complain anymore. And threaten to to leave leave the company leave the biggest bit best company in new york just for a cup of coffee yeah i've always wondered like is this supposed to be the kitchen and this is supposed to be a bathroom but in the same time i haven't seen any kind of bathroom stuff right so i don't know i'll just put it in here for now because i just don't have anything better to do with it Okay, I think we're actually done. I think we're actually done for the day. I could have went and helped, right? I could have went and helped in the sh in the store. So let's go to sleep. Five more hours. Okay, so I think I think I'm gonna leave this uh, episode here. I think we recovered. We just You're made. You're really oh, getting the hang of this, this stuff. So I think it's time for you to move into some new territory: office-based businesses. It's similar to retail businesses, but it's important to consider what's in demand in your specific neighborhood. You know what to do, so do it. Okay, so we just finished the 3,000 profit per day. We just did it, okay? Uh, we're going well. So I'm going to leave this up episode here, guys. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget, you can also see me almost daily on Twitch. Uh, yeah, twitch.tv slash bobbytw. You're going to have the link in the description as well. And I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.